Okay, Coach Acid, so Cedar Point Duels yep. brought a squad. Yeah. Real squad. Yeah. Okay, I, I'm looking at big things today, but yeah. when you can do an event that's going to have multi state teams yeah. right here within an hour, coming right from Brexville, right? Yeah. You live in Brexville still. Yeah. Yep. Quick, quick to run down here to, to Sandusky. Yeah. Facility's great. Yeah, I love it here. They do a great job. They what are the awesome. expectations when you come to an event like this? Uh, so the expectations is just continue to train hard. We've been uh, preparing for events like this. You know, there's only a few throughout the summer. So this is a great opportunity to continue your training cycle, get after it, uh, make sure. I'm real big on making sure we're scoring points. Um, in duels like high school, you know, if the match is 8-0, we're losing, making sure we're getting that take down to, for the team, things like that. So I just look for fighting effort when we come to these events. So this one's not freestyle, it's folk style. Yeah. Doing a little gear shift, right? Yeah, yeah we've been we've been freestyle, um, but I have we have practice once a day for folk style, so kind of switch gears like that. I think it's important to continue to do folk style occasionally throughout the year, um, even in the off season. So unique format too yes. you guys young guys wrestling with old guys little yeah. tiny weights how many weights are there total 18 18 yeah those are my favorite duels because the younger kids they get to see some of the older kids compete and the older kids have a chance to be leaders um so i love the k-3 events yeah k-3 is yeah. definitely a different deal it's, yeah. it's it's really different uh when you guys look at the teams that are here they got clarkston yeah. michigan they got a couple different oh that was a nasty throw as i was looking over my shoulder sorry that was a sick throw i think Anyhow, you know, when you come to these events and they got, it's not just Ohio teams and you're getting some new guys. Yeah. What's that like for you guys? I think it's awesome. Uh, you know, with the pandemic and everything going on, we're wrestling a lot of same, same guys. So this is a great opportunity to wrestle some other teams, some other guys, some high level competition. So excited. Are you guys going to Cedar Point? Yes. You are? Yeah. It's like a group? Oh, no, we're not going as a group, but we're, we get some tickets. So. Be cool. Maybe we should uh, schedule a little, a little day to get together. Well, that's together what it goes. is. Yeah. It's like you get because yeah, I think I all the college teams are going as a group. Oh, they are. Yeah, I think that's what Jared was saying. Like, there's some of them that because like Binghamton. Yeah, because we might be done pretty early. I think that, yeah, you could probably go tonight if you yeah. wanted to. But I mean, I'm a I'm a Twilight guy. Yeah. Twilight is like you just go Sunday evening. Ri I'm a ride rider. Yeah. I don't like to just like go to Cedar Point and hang out. I ride rides. Yeah. Then I'm like ready to go. Yeah. But it's a cool experience, you know. Yeah. I grew up going there. Yeah. Uh, but that's a cool another benefit of coming to this, right? Oh, Every yeah. guy got a QR yeah. code to get in. Yeah. Can they yeah. use it throughout the summer? Yeah, I believe so. I think they get five tickets. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So. That's a good deal. Yeah. All right. You guys got the rest of this round off. It's. I see the bigger guys coming on the mat. You got anything else for me? No, yeah, just uh, it's gonna be a good day and uh, gonna have some fun. Good luck to you guys. Yeah. Thank you.